Let's have a look at some of the other stories tonight now. It is a simple torch, but it could revolutionise healthcare in the developing world. Weighing in at just 30 grams and costing less than £2 to make, it has caught the attention of the medical community. Sky's health correspondent Thomas Moore explains what it does. It's an invention that could save the sight, if not the lives, of millions of people in the third world. Using his wife as a guinea pig, this retired surgeon has designed a simple ophthalmoscope for looking at the back of the eye. It's nothing more than a torch, a pinhole and a mirror, but this tiny device can help to diagnose glaucoma, diabetes, malaria and brain tumours. Most doctors should be able to at least say, I've seen some tiny little hemorrhages in the eye and therefore I need to refer the patient to a specialist. And that might be enough to save their uh, life. Millions of people in developing countries go blind every year because their eye diseases aren't picked up soon enough. Few field doctors carry ophthalmoscopes because at £200 they're too expensive. But the new device costs just £2. And its potential is so great that it's been given a major award for medical innovation. It came down to three principal reasons. Number one was really the simplicity and the novelty of the innovation. Number two really is the commercial potential that this could have. And the third, most important and foremost, really is the ability to improve patient care. The new ophthalmoscope wins £10,000 from the National Endowment for Science, Technology and the Arts. Further funding could follow and if all goes well, it should be available to third world medics in just 12 months' time. But the prototype has already helped to make one diagnosis. While checking his own eyes, Roger Armour found his diabetes had damaged blood vessels in his retina. His hope now that a device put together in his front room could prevent blindness around the world. Thomas Moore, Sky News.